Welcome back to GMA3. Pickleball is the fastest growing sport in the country with almost 5 million people now playing across the U.S. Everybody's talking about it, but how do the health benefits match up to America's other favorite racket game, tennis? A brand new study is breaking it all down, and Dr. Jane is here to serve up the facts for us. Okay, Eva's tried it. I've tried pickleball. You have, not, have not yet. So tennis I have. Maybe that's another uh, field shoot that we can work Check on. It out. You guys, this is interesting data. It's an Apple movement study done in collaboration with the American Heart Association and Brigham and Women's Hospital using Apple Watches or, you know, the, all of the wearable technology that's out there now comparing these two popular sports. Um, so here's some of the key data points they found. How long do people play on average? Well, if you're talking about pickleball, 90 minutes, tennis, 81 minutes. What happens to your heart rate, let's say, when you're mm -hmm. playing? That's obviously something that can be easily tracked. Um, pickleball, we're averaging around 143 beats per minute um, as a peak. Tennis, a little higher, 152 beats. We've so talked does that about mean that. tennis is a better workout? I mean, you and I talked about and I'm how hard tennis is. I need like an oxygen tank <laughs> when I play tennis. So, you know, to me that makes sense. And then they're looking at something subjective, you know, the presence or change in mood, particularly depressed mood. They found that with pickleball, uh, there was a reduction in about 60% in the perception of a depressed mood. Tennis, about 51%. Now, here are the caveats with these numbers, you guys. They seem seem like pickleball is winning over tennis, but we don't know about the statistical significance in the terms of the way these numbers were analyzed on this study. So it might be, actually it looks different, but 9% difference is not significant. Um, you know, you can't say, well, a tennis court is larger, therefore it's going to raise your heart rate more. Um, you know what is interesting though? Longevity has been associated with any racket oh, sport. Oh. So you can add table tennis, you can add I'm interested now. You can see? There you go. So I think the bottom line is, if you like one versus the other, just get out there and do it. You're going to get benefits with it.